If you were blind and felt no pain, would it matter if you're also ugly? Hey guys, Trace here for D News. Okay, so that question from a second ago probably doesn't resonate with most of you because you're so pretty. And if it does, I'm sorry. But when it comes to naked mole rats, maybe it's something we should be asking. I say that because naked mole rats are arguably the weirdest animal on our planet. Not only do they look like a pig's grandpa stuffed inside a bratwurst, but they also have some amazing capabilities. One might even call them superpowers. A mole rat is a type of rodent. There are about 30 different kinds, but the most famous are naked mole rats. These tiny animals love to burrow in sandy or loamy soil, and as a result are mostly found in sub-Saharan Africa. But they can also be found in southeastern Europe, the Middle East, and the Mediterranean, although you probably won't see one because naked mole rats live in huge colonies underground, coming up only occasionally to rummage for seeds and plants. Though mole rats are mammals, their lifestyle has much in common with that of insects. For instance, in their colonies, every rat has a specific job. Some act as soldiers by forcefully warding off outside invaders, while others tend to the young, clean burrows, dig tunnels, or scavenge for food. This system is predicated on a strict social hierarchy. The higher echelon rats are known to trample on or otherwise physically intimidate other rats. And at the top, of course, is a queen. The queen is kind of a jerk. She asserts her power by trampling other rats. You could almost call her a tramp queen, almost. She's the only female in the colony having babies and bones tons of male rats using intimidation to keep other females from having their own babies. To keep up with baby production, the queen can actually stretch the space between her vertebrae and her backbone to make room for more pups. Queen rats can rule for 13 to 18 years, and after they die, other female rats fight, sometimes to the death, over who will take her place. And remember, this is all happening underground in complete darkness. To cope with all that darkness, naked mole rats have developed a number of unique characteristics. For instance, to dig tunnels and gnaw away at large tubers, they use their exterior buck teeth, which can actually move independently like chopsticks. And although they're almost completely blind, they can sense their surroundings using tiny hairs all over their body. And in case you somehow didn't think they were weird already, they also evolved to feel no pain, as their skin lacks a key neurotransmitter that connects their brain to their central nervous system. Plus, they can live for more than 30 years and they almost never get cancer. Scientists think this is because they have two unique genes that prevent uncontrolled cell production. But to be honest, all that is child's play. The coolest thing naked mole rats do is eat. They mostly consume large tubers, which is a type of root. You might think of potatoes, but that's just one kind of tuber. The mole rats gnaw away at these things in large groups, which is cool because to do so, they have to suspend their rules of rigid social order. When they're not feeding on tubers, naked mole rats are eating their own poop because feces are full of microscopic organisms which help the mole rats digest their food. They also roll around in it so they can identify those in their colony by their smell. Look, these things are gross and weird and strange and weird and stinky and weird, but like so many animals on this great planet of ours, they're also awesome. If you want to know about another super animal, check out this one. Might surprise you. It's a pigeon. I know. Check it out. Do you have any other animals that you want us to highlight? Let us know in the comments. Make sure you subscribe so you get more D News. And thanks for watching.